Alleluia. Children, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. My name is Brother Anthony Mwani. I am, my address is number 33 Gunu Street, Urile Igomu. My branch is Urile 2 branch. I joined the Lord Chosen in the year 2013. Thank I am you, happy Lord. for I am a chosen. Thank you, Father. Chosen, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Moderator, sir, can I render a short song to God? Please sing. I have come to thank you, the God of chosen. I have come to thank you for what you have done. I have come to thank you, the God of chosen. I have come to thank you for what you have done. I have come to thank you, the God of chosen. I have come to thank you for what you have done. I have come to thank you, the God of chosen. I have come to thank you for what you have done. Chosen, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. My brethren, I want to appreciate this good God for what he has done for me. In fact, right from the day I became a chosen, this very God has never failed me. Chosen, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I'm full of testimony. In fact, my second name should be testimony. Hmm. Because right from that first 2013 to today, I have been, in fact, I have gone through several problems, challenges, but this very God of chosen, the God of my pastor, have actually seen me through them all. Chosen, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. This very morning, I have come to testify once again what this very good God has done it for me. In fact, in the month of August, it was very terrible for me, though I continue to endure believing in this very good God, knowing what He can do, and because He has done, He has been doing it in my life. I, in fact, in that very period, my whole body is full of pain. I cannot sit down. I cannot lie down. Full of pain all over my body. 24 hours. Then at a time when this thing is too much, I have to go and for tests. I say, let me know exactly if there is anything wrong with any of my organs. And eventually when I went for tests, they traced, did tests for me on every part of my organ and everything they said everything is okay I'm fully okay the kidney the liver everything is sound is okay working fine they said but I have to still go for x-ray to find out the problem and eventually when I went for the x-ray the result came out and they said uh, my part of my waist have shifted have shifted and uh, according to the x-ray I have here, sorry sir, according to the result, what, uh, because this is exactly what they said, uh, is lumbar spondylosis with multi-level disc degeneration. <laughs> I don't actually understand this. But then, one thing I understand is, Immediately they had, I said, okay, what is the solution? They said, my brother, they don't do this. They no operation for this thing. It's something you have to see how you are going to manage you. Because uh, if I, I can see some people walking on the road, you can see some people uh, bending. Even to the extent that some people may even paralyze some people. I say, okay, no problem. It's well. Because I know where I belong to. Chosen, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. And uh, thank God, the following Thursday, I packaged the x-ray with the report. I came to this very church. I had some brethren, even in my own department, they were asking me, uh, uh, what, which one are you carrying? I said, don't worry. So when the time, when our daddy started to pray, I brought it out of the uh, poly bag, 
I, it wasn't true. So I raised it up. I raised up the report that he prayed. And said, you that has any uh, problem in your backbone, today I'm replacing that bone in Jesus' name. I said, Amen. I was so happy. I jumped up. I said, Daddy, I've mentioned it. Chosen, praise the Lord. And I sowed seed. I went to him. I drop it. And uh, every service I come, I continue sowing seed. And Daddy continued to mention it in prayer. I want to tell us that today, that very report has been squashed. That today I'm standing like a fiddle. There is no pain, no pain, nothing at all. Nothing, nothing, nothing. In fact, I have actually gone back to tell them that uh, <laughs> because when they gave me this report, I said, don't worry. It's a song our daddy normally sing to us. We say uh, another challenge. So whenever something like this come up, it's another challenge. So that uh, uh, for me to, now to redouble the little I have effort I have been putting in the service of this God. Choosing praise the Lord. Hallelujah. So this is my wonderful my testimony for this what this God has done in my life. Today I'm full, sound, and healthy. Clap your hands unto God of the choosing. Chosen, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. So I want to pray for our daddy. In fact, this God of choosing has done so much, so much. I have suffered partial stroke. I have been healed. I have eye problem. I used glasses before. People, I used glasses before I came to choosing. I cannot even watch television. I cannot see. But today I don't use. I can see the tiniest thing. There are so, so much testimony in my life. I have even liver problem, kidney problem, all these things. I have gone through them. But God of choosing has seen me through all these ones. Choosing praise the Lord. Hallelujah. So, I want to pray for our daddy. First of all, my humble advice to us is that uh, we the brethren that have been members of this ministry, we have to follow this very God faithfully and obediently according to the teaching our daddy is teaching. Uh, is teaching us to follow obediently and faithfully because I so much believe whenever we come here like even today as he's going to pray probably you are coming here with this type of my uh, the day like the day I came with this uh, big uh, report from these uh, medical people and after praying you have to believe that once the man of God has prayed, it is done. He will always say, it is done. And go back, and it is done. Choosing praise the Lord. Amen. And not continue troubling him, trying to find how you can meet him, how you can do it. Just believe in this prayer. That is how I've been operating, and it has been working for me. Amen. Choosing praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I want to pray for my pastor. Daddy, it is well with you. Amen. It is well with your family. Amen. It is well with your ministry. Amen. Father, I pray that my daddy will fulfill his ministry in Jesus' name. Amen. Everything that my pastor needed, every enablement he need, Father, supply it to my daddy in Jesus' name. Amen. His expectation is for 10 billion souls. And I pray that this 10 billion souls, God Almighty, as my pastor is working day and night to make sure that this vision is fulfilled, Father, I pray that by your grace and power that you will actualize it according to the desire of my pastor in Jesus' name. Amen. I pray for all the chosen brethren. It is well with us. As we hear this, we will hear my testimony today. I pray that one day you also stand here and people will hear your own testimony in Jesus' name. Amen. For our newcomers, I want to encourage you. This is the final bus stop. This is the final. There is no, there is no two way. I have also, I came from the Catholic background. I was the, also one of the leaders, not even, I, I, one of the leaders. Choosing praise the Lord. Hallelujah. So, I want to say, please, stay put. 
As you continue, this God of choosing will never fail you in Jesus' name. Amen. Choosing, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I pray for heaven and last for my pastor and his family. I pray for heaven and last for all the chosen brethren. I also pray for heaven and last for me and my family in Jesus' name. Amen. Choosing, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Let's clap unto God and appreciate him. Before second to the last testifier, let's quickly take these few announcements. All chair department members are to meet in their office.